In this video, Timmy's going to show you how to enable dark mode on a Chromebook so that everything will look dark. This is great if you want to use your Chromebook in a dark room without such a bright light shining in your face, or it's also nice if you just prefer the look of dark mode. And dark mode can supposedly slightly improve your Chromebook's battery life, which is an added bonus. So to enable dark mode on your Chromebook, you will just need to click on the time down here. So just sort of this button thing here, and it'll bring up these icons. So your menu here might look like that, but if it looks like this, you'll just need to click on the up arrow and it'll be expanded and you get all these other options. And now you'll just need to find the dark mode option. So it might be somewhere here, but it'll probably be on the next page. So you'll probably need to click this dot here to go to the next page. And here it is called dark theme. So if you just click on that, it'll be dark mode. And now everything's dark. So this menu is dark. This bottom bar is dark and the app drawer is dark. And if you open up certain built in Chromebook apps, like the files app, the files app will all be dark. And if we open up Google Chrome, Google Chrome will be dark. And if you go to a website that supports dark mode, like YouTube, YouTube will automatically be in dark mode as well, as you can see here. So that's really cool. And when you no longer want to be in dark mode, you can simply come back into this menu here and find the dark mode icon again and click on it and it will turn off. So now everything is back to normal, all looking bright and white. But if you don't want to have to keep changing it from light to dark mode yourself, you can actually set it so that it will automatically switch to dark mode at night when it's dark and then automatically switch back to light mode in the morning when it's light again. So to do that, you'll need to right click on the bottom bar across the bottom of the screen, which is called the bookshelf. So if you have a mouse, just click with the right click button and it'll bring up this menu. But if you don't have a mouse and you just have a trackpad, just hover your mouse over the bar like that and click down with two fingers at the same time. So it's like you're clicking, but you're doing it with two fingers. So to me, click like that. And now we have this same menu here. And now in this menu, click set wallpaper and style. So now there's a lot of different options in here, but the only option you'll need to set is where it says theme here. So you have light and dark, and you can actually switch between the two of them from this menu. But if you click auto here, now it will be on auto. So now whenever it's daytime, like it is right now, everything will be light. And then whenever it's nighttime and it's dark outside, it'll all be dark. One thing to me has noticed is if you manually turn dark mode on and off, so you manually go into the settings here and you find the icon and you click it, it will then completely turn off this auto setting. So if you ever have to manually turn it on and off for some reason, you will need to come back in here and switch it back to auto again. But as long as you leave it on auto, it works really well. So that's really cool. But one more thing to me wants to show you is the wallpapers. If you already have a specific wallpaper that you really want to keep, you might not want to do this and that's fine. But if you're happy to use any of the built in Google wallpapers, some of them now have a dark and light version. And if you use a wallpaper that has a dark and light version, it will automatically switch to the dark version whenever your Chromebook is in dark mode and then switch back to the light version again whenever your Chromebook is in light mode. So if we come into the wallpaper options here, so this is the, the same menu where we right clicked and brought up this. If we click wallpaper here, now there's a whole lot of wallpaper options and to me shows you all about changing your wallpaper in a different video, which will be linked to down below. But if you come down to either element or radiance, 
To me, guessing in the future there will be more wallpapers that support dark mode, but for now, any of the eight images in Element or Radiance do. So if you just click on one of these categories and choose a wallpaper, like maybe this green one, as you can see, it will set it as the light wallpaper now. So now it's all a light wallpaper because we're in light mode at the moment. But if we come in here and go over here and turn on dark mode, the wallpaper will suddenly turn really dark. So now when you're in dark mode, your entire Chromebook will seem darker because the wallpaper will be dark. And it will also automatically do it if you have dark mode on auto. So then when it gets dark outside, you'll end up with a dark wallpaper, which is really kind of cool. And that's all there is to enabling dark mode on a Chromebook. So that's really cool. But if you want to enable dark mode in Google Docs so that there'll be even less bright light coming from your Chromebook screen, Timmy shows you how to do that in this video here.